What is up guys, Johnny here. I'm back with another Call of Duty Mobile video. In today's video, a full tutorial step by step on how to play Call of Duty Mobile on any Android device or iOS device and how to download it on iOS and Android. As you can see, I'm playing on my iPad right now. Uh, iOS device, Call of Duty Mobile out now. In certain regions, it is not globally launched yet but it's out in Canada and Australia. So before we start guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel and drop the like, let's get started. So first of all, a lot of people are wondering, how is it not working? I got the Android or iOS device, I did download Call of Duty Mobile and it's not started, I get an error message. So there's two things guys, first is getting the game on your device, but also the region problem. I'm guessing most of you guys, if you're having problem playing Call of Duty on your device, probably you're not in Canada or not in Australia, right? Pretty sure I'm right. So that could be the problem, but there's a workaround it, guys. Don't worry about that. I got you covered today, but we will go step by step for iOS first and step by step for Android second because it's two different uh, ways to do it, all right? But step one, whether you're on Android or iOS, it's the same first step you guys should have a vpn that would be the first step now a lot of guys are scared to use vpn is it illegal or something dude just google it guys google is it illegal to use a vpn it's 100 percent legal okay and it's even recommended going online using a vpn to secure your data and uh, be safe on the internet okay some vpn are free some are expensive some of them have free trials but some of them are not working also for Call of Duty Mobile. I know Proton VPN has been uh, very successful. A lot of guys using Proton VPN. So you can go on uh, App Store or Google Play Store, download Proton VPN, and you can get a free trial. If not, there's another one I know is really popular. UFO VPN has been reported to be working pretty good for a lot of players outside Canada and Australia. So you might also want to check out that one. But you can also do a quick search on Google, the top five VPN right now to play Call of Duty Mobile. I know some of them are premium, but like I said, a lot of people are asking, what's going to happen after my free trial? Well, two things can happen. First of all, maybe the game will be launched already because we have no idea about the release date yet. It could be very soon. This is soft launch. It's no longer beta. So the game could launch any time now. So after your free trial, maybe you won't need a VPN anymore, or you can just download another VPN and get another free trial on another VPN. But anyways, check out uh, UFO. I'm not sponsored by the way, and I don't use that. It's just, I read a lot and I've seen a lot of players use VPNs. So UFO VPN, Proton VPN, there's a bunch of other options out there. Just choose the VPN you like, download, install, get it started and check out your server because you got to choose your location and once again canada or australia you might want to check which one is closer to your location so that would be step one for android or ios you guys need a vpn if you don't live in canada or if you don't live in australia let's go to step two now we're gonna go for ios first now if you search call of duty mobile on your app store if you're not in canada or australia you will not find the game that will be the first major problem is the location, all right? And it's not related to the VPN. All you gotta do is log out of your iOS account and you have to create a new account. You can create a Canadian account or an Australian account. To create a new iOS or Apple account, you need a valid address. So you can go on Google, just search a random uh, address generator and generate a Canadian address or an Australian address with the zip code and everything and you can create your new Apple ID account for Canada or Australia. And now, once you get the right region, the game should appear on your App Store. Now, a second thing, even if you're in the right region, if you search Call of Duty Mobile, there is a chance that you might not see it. So instead of searching Call of Duty Mobile, you want to search Visceral Multiplayer. You can see it on the search box. I will also type it in the description below. It's just a random keyword search type thing. Uh, but yeah, sometimes if you search just visceral, V-I-S-C-E-R-A-L, 
and it's gonna show the game right away. That's what I did the first day, and I'm in Canada. And Call of Duty Mobile, the game did not pop on my search result. So once I typed Visceral, it, I got it straight away. So if you have this problem, you might wanna try Visceral instead of Call of Duty Mobile. And you're pretty much set, guys. Once you got the right region, download Call of Duty Mobile, install. And just one thing, guys, before you launch the game, you might want to check or double check that your VPN is open and you are on a server of the right region. So you might want to try different servers to get the ones that are working the best. You will see different performance depending on the time of the day and what server you're using, but definitely uh, search one until you can find a good one. And once you're connected to Australian server or Canadian server, then and only then you should launch the game and it will be all good to go. Now, if you have an error, just restart or force stop the app and open it again. But it's been reported to work for most of the players that do the steps in order. But that's it for iOS, guys. Leave a comment below if it worked for you or if you have any problem logging in or getting into the game. I'm sure people in the comments will be able to maybe help you guys. But if you follow the steps in order, you should be good. Now, let's go to Android because it's a bit more complicated. Now once again for Android, you followed step one, you got a VPN, you're ready to go. You're gonna go on TapTap, Tap. it's an app or a website, I will put the link in the description also. You're gonna go on TapTap Tap and you should find Call of Duty Mobile on the front page and then you have the option to download or try. You should click try and install Call of Duty Mobile on your device. Again, once you're done installing and downloading the game, you have option to open or just click done. Do not open the game yet. Make sure you just click done and check if your VPN is open, if you're connected to a Canadian server or Australian server, and then again, you can launch the app and you should be good to go. If you have an extra step for Android device, you need to download the game through TapTap. If you guys have any other recommendations or any other workaround, leave a comment below once again. How did you get to play on your Android device if you're not in Canada or Australia. I will leave you guys with some gameplay now. Hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Hit the like if it helped. And once again, leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more Call of Duty Mobile gameplay news and guides. I will be back soon. Till then, watch my other videos. Take care. Right, let's go to the safe zone. I think I'll end the stream early, guys. I really struggle right now. Reloading. And I want to switch my SMG to maybe a uh, AR or something else. Where this guy come from? Now I need to heal for real. This is not gonna be alone, right? I need to heal. Using first aid kit now. If it was not a butt, I would be dead. Striker, shotgun. Zombies incoming. Engaging zombies. Engaging zombies. Ready for someone shot. Oh wow, it's the zombie bomb that got me. Thank you boys, that was two guys. Yeah, zombies is like a skill. You throw a bomb, it's gonna make noise. And some zombies will come, so it will distract your opponents. And zombies can kill them.
Just need to heal, man. Yeah, clown, clown bomb, but then it explodes. The Hellhound is down to half health. There's also a crate in the middle of the field. It's guarded by a Hellhound. So if you kill the beast, it unlocks the crate. See that crate here? It's got crazy good materials. It can have like good vest, good weapons and stuff. See, quick draw. Um, SMG mag backpack stuff like that. So if you go there at the start of the game, it can give you a, a little jump, you know. Enemy is near. Zombies in cover fire. Engaging with enemies. Reloading. Uh oh. Come on, man. Always scared as hell. Level 3 vest. But I keep getting damaged. Français de France ou Français du Québec? On a beaucoup de Français ici, par Uh, Danny Rain, Francais Jimmy, um, you you used to live in Canada. Only two teams left, getting close to victory. Uh, Philo Chaser is French, also. I, I got a lot of French uh, people from France, France. Ricky Bobby. <laughs> Bro, this movie is such a classic, man. Say it or I will break your arm. Say I love crepes. I love crepes. Just say it, dude. Reloading. Say it. Air no, bomb. don't say it. There's only one guy left. I'm guarding this spot. I've been hit. Engaging with enemy. It's over. This is a win. Aspect, thanks for the game. Aspect with 12 kills?